Anthony, what was your key to uh, look rust free here tonight? Uh, I actually felt rusty in the first. Uh, but, uh, you know, it's just one of those games where, you know, you have to battle. You got to get some games to get back in shape. And there's nothing like a game for a goalie. So um, it was it was demanding, but um, felt pretty good, like, midway through the game. Felt I know, better. I know shooters probably get frustrated when they miss golden opportunities. How frustrating is it for a goalie who's down by one to see some of those chances go by the wayside? Yeah, definitely you want, uh, you want to see those one go in. But I thought we battled hard tonight. We... We had some great chances to, to, you know, to win this game, but we just came up short. How difficult is it to rehab an injury when you have that long break? Uh, I, I just think the timing with uh, the bye week was kind of a tough, tough one because I was pretty close to come back from uh, for mini, but then you have the bye week and you're missing, you know, four or five days off the ice. So, uh, you know, I came back early to, to get some skate, but I haven't really had a much much of a chance to practice with the guys. So, uh, but I felt pretty good. Sal did a good job to get me ready. You know what? Uh, I thought we played a pretty solid game. We had our chances. We just didn't put them in the net, and uh, you know, pucks are bouncing everywhere, and um, you know, we just couldn't get one to land on our stick and bounce for us. And um, you know, just the way it goes. Lundqvist is a great goalie. Yeah. Stopped everything in front of him, but we had some chances where you know I had a breakaway and had him beat, and um, just didn't go in. It's just the story of, of tonight, and um, you know. And, and the one that hopped over your stick, which one will, will haunt you more? Uh, you know, the probably the one over my stick. Both of them. You know, we were all over it. The one that hopped over Fab's stick at the end. Um, you know, just a bouncy ball out there. You, you know, we're just hoping, and you know, we did enough to create for ourselves and. Uh, you know, we just need one of those to land on our stick and, and bounce in the net. It seems like that's the story of the season. You guys, is, or part of it, lack of puck luck that um, other teams have it and you guys don't. Yeah, well, I'd say any kind of luck, but, uh, you know, you create bounces for yourself by working hard and, and going to the right spots. And, um, you know what, I think if we do that, like we did tonight, um, on a consistent basis, uh, you know, we'll get we'll get some bounces here and, and uh uh, you know, we'll put some uh, put some pucks in the back of the net. I mean, Bernie was picked up where he left off, and uh, you know, before his injury, and um, you know, it was it was great. It was a much different team tonight for us than 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 when, what it was last night at the Garden. When you see Valtteri miss a chance like that, do you just groan, or I mean, that was <laughs> yeah, it was it was right there. I mean, it's it's tough. Yeah, every it's happened to every player. Um, you know what? So yeah, you, you're hoping. Um, for uh, one on his 1,000th game, uh, which is an amazing accomplishment. And someone that, uh, if anyone deserves that to go in, it's, it's him. And, uh, you know, it just, just was a story of the night for us. How much will that one haunt you later on tonight, losing by one in the end? Uh, I mean, that's worse, obviously. I felt like we had a lot of other good chances as well. Uh, for sure, it wouldn't be nice to score, score that one. But uh, tough loss. I felt like we played well today. Uh, great, a lot of chances. Uh, didn't give a whole lot. Uh, tough one, one nothing loss. Uh, now that this milestone's in the books for you, uh, how do you feel about it? Uh, I feel good. I'm actually proud of the fact that I've been able to uh, stay healthy and play play in the top top league for a while. So uh, proud of that part. Uh, hopefully, have a little bit, a little more left in me and uh, get some few more games. You to have you. your family here too. What does that mean to you today? It means a lot. I'm happy they were able to uh, come over. Obviously, it's tough to. Tough to plan. You miss one game and the game moves on. So, uh, but I'm really happy about they were able to fly, fly over. You've played a lot of games, have a lot of experience. Is there anything you can look to as far as when a team just seems to have no puck luck? Like, what what can you do? Is there anything? Uh, not much. I think you just have to try and play the right way, do the right things, and and earn your bounces. Uh, I think if keep playing this way, you're gonna we're gonna get some some bounces and get some get some goals and, and create a little bit more offense and and uh, just can't give up. Just gotta keep going. It's one of the keys too to, to playing this way is just getting more pucks on net. You got 33 shots uh, tonight, which is a good number. Is that kind of like what you have to do? You have that shooting mentality as a team? Yeah, for sure. Uh, obviously, when you get when you get shots, you get a lot of time to get second opportunities, third opportunities, and and those are tough tough for goalies. So uh, gotta keep doing that for sure. I mean, we were way better. We looked like a hockey team, you know. Um, 
it's certainly frustrating not to win, but but that's uh, that you know from a process standpoint we were way better. Uh, I thought we we executed better. We had more confidence. We were more poised with the puck, so we did more with the puck. Um, we weren't perfect. We gave up some chances, um, but that's a, that's the way that we have to keep continuing to try to play on a nightly basis, how to take steps forward. And I, I thought. Uh, uh, you know, we got second period. I didn't love us uh, right away. We took too long a shift, and then you take a penalty. So I didn't love us in the second. We still got to keep working on making sure we keep those shifts short, and we're, we're getting people on and off the ice. Um, but overall, it was, it was uh, a step in the right direction. Did you assess Bernier, especially after the layoff? Uh, yeah, both goalies were great. I thought uh, they both made, <laughs> made lots of saves. I thought Bernie looked solid. Yeah, I, th I thought we were, uh, you know, in fairness to, to how we played a couple of games, uh, the last game in the game in mini and that, where I thought uh, we weren't nearly as good defensively. I thought we were better defensively. They still created, but they created, uh, I thought, uh, enough of those were because of their, their some of their elite skill, you know. Um, not that some of them weren't mistakes, but uh, I thought we were way better defensively, and I thought Bernie was real solid. Hopefully I had that amazing chance. Still had mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. You know, that the, the, was tough to watch uh, at the end there that, that, not, that they didn't go in. I mean, you, you, you want to get rewarded for it, and, uh, um, and, and we didn't. Uh, you know, I think, I think Abby had an open net there late, too, in the third. Um, so, you know, that's, uh, that's, that's, uh, that's the reality of, uh, of sports. We, we can't control that, but we can control, uh, you know, how our approach every day. We can control uh, how we keep going at it. And uh, I thought our guys responded very well today after a disappointing uh, performance last night.